many miles of this, but we're almost there. Yeah. Definitely out there this time. everyone it is 8 14 p.m. I mean a.m. sorry we are about to do the balsam lake trail to the fire tower at the top of the mountain and um, I hope you'll watch till the end because today's gonna be a pretty exciting day we are in the Catskills and Logan is going to bag his first 35 today. So let's hit that trail. Okay. Hitting that trail. Hitting that trail. If you carry it in, carry it out. So we're on blue. Yeah, it's pretty smooth walking. So far. So far. We are registered and on our way. Wait, why do we need to register? Well, many different reasons. They know you came this way. They know we'll look for you if you don't come back out. And they also keep track of how many people use the trail. Oh, nice. I think we're the first people of the day. I think we are. I can tell that without even uh, looking at the register because I've been knocking down cobwebs the whole way up here. Mm -hmm. All right, let's hit it. So we're doing Balsam Lake Mountain tonight, today. Yep. It is in the 3500 Club. Yep. Can't remember exactly what it is. I think it's. 3720 or something like that. There's a fire tower up there. Yeah, that's my most exciting part. Yep, should get a good view. And this will be Logan's first 35 Hooray. of the Cash Skill 35 Challenge. So, uh. And also the fire tower challenge. And the fire tower challenge, that's right. So we'll see how that goes. This was a last minute change up. We were going to do Slide Mountain, which is the tallest of the Catskills, but that what's that? That's not that, that is close to 4,200. It's like 4,170 or something like that. Whoa. But uh, they've had like two and a half inches of rain. Mm -hmm. And there's a couple decent creek crossings there that probably wouldn't be passable so we switched it up and came up here yep so we'll see how it goes just the constant up Already shedding layers, huh? Yep. This is a long, continual climb. Yep. I feel a bit better now. We have a choice to make now, bud. Mm -hmm. So, we can turn on to the red trail. 
and it's gonna get cat skilly super quick. Yeah. Or we can continue down the blue trail. It adds about a mile, mm -hmm. but that'll do more of a switch back up to the fire tower. And then we can come back down this. Oh, okay. I mean, if you want to do it, that's fine, but I'm not sure that... Uh... I want to do this. Okay, and we'll come down the red one? Yeah. Should ease into it. Mm -hmm. But this is probably uh, under a mile up to the fire tower, but it's, like I said, pretty cat skilly. A mile up to the fire tower? Yep. And the lean twos up there, the spring is up there. Um, but it gets steep. I remember that. Wait, you've been here before? I have. Oh, neat. I have a turtle shell. This feels like a good place to stop for a minute. Part of me wishes that we just would have taken the red trail and got it over with. Daddy's not a fan of the long, constant just ramp for miles, but that's all right. Yeah. Still better than Pennsylvania Rock. Does just keep going. That's why I never really trust mountain trails. They always seem to be up to something. It's good to have a pack off break. Yep. Helps dry you off a little bit. These Gregory packs are great, but no matter what in July, you're gonna sweat. The back sweat to a minimum. And they work pretty good. Yep. All right, let's go find that left turn. Okay, I'm pretty sure the sign up ahead is back. <clears throat> I hope you're right. I want to get to the top of this mountain so we can eat and climb a fire tower. And it is 9.35 and we've been totally chilling, just taking our time, lots of breaks. It's... No rush. Nope, no rush. It's very humid in the forest, so. I'm quite cooled down now, so that's pretty cool. <laughs> I only saw the white sign. Yeah. But... So I read that. See that white sign that you saw? Yeah. I was I was thinking about this the other day. I read this. Oh. Um, I think it was January of this year. They closed Grand Mountain and another one. But they're on the uh, list of 35s. So how do you complete your 35 club now that they're privatized? But anyway, we got three quarters of a mile up that trail to the fire tower. So let's hit it. All right, let's truck it. 
red. Now we're on red. New York's pretty good about keeping the trailers well marked and well preserved. Once we get a little closer, we should be popping into the balsam fir. It's a balsam fir. It's kind of like a type of, well, I guess we'll call it pine. Still looking for that 3,500 feet elevation sign. Up, up, up. Congratulations, buddy. Thank you. Only 270 more feet to go. Yep. But open fires are not permitted above the elevation throughout the year. Camping is not permitted. This elevation from March 21 to December 21 each year. I guess in January you're allowed to camp up here. But that'd be... Pretty crazy, because January this high up is not going to be fun for anyone. Because it, one, it's snowy, and two, it's rocky. Mm -hmm. It's very snowy here. All right. On to the fire tower. Well, knew it had to get steep at some point. Yep. Okay, let's hit it. Steep, steep. Steep, steep. Definitely out of breath. We are in the balsams now. Which means we're getting close. You'll have to get a bladder for your pack. Yeah, maybe. I doesn't really like them too much. Mm, I like them. Cause... Yeah, I, they, they have their pros and cons. Yeah, because they have, it's easier to get than reaching It is. You're right on that. All right. Looks like we got at least a little bit of a break from the steep stuff. Yep. And let's see. Thirty-six, thirty-four. So probably, I don't know, I think it's around 100 feet more of uh, elevation gain okay. so there'll be a couple more steep spots i can't if the fire tower is open i highly doubt it well we can still climb up to almost the top if even if it's not it's at the watcher's cabin yeah i think we are because i see a building made out of blocks. well that's just the foundation Hello. Hello. How are you? Well, working on any fire tower challenges or something like that? Well, we are actually. That's good. This little bird yesterday yeah. flying in and out of the grass and we yet. discovered the nest. I've never with seen five the eggs. actual eggs. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. We, it, we, uh, there was all kinds of she wildlife built it there yesterday. Right in the grass. With all the people in this clearing. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> that is strange. This is ST98. Sean. Oh, really? Oh, I didn't. <laughs> Small world sometimes. Usually <laughs> when I'm up here, there's no one up here. Yeah. <laughs> Do we know one named Sean? Hmm? Do we know someone named Sean? Well, I know lots of people named Sean. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> I might go use that. Do you want to use it? Yeah. 
idea. All right, go Just ahead. Just in case. Go ahead. Uh, probably the front. First privy. You might have to have your dad help you. They kind of pop open. It's mm. kind of weird. Let's see. Yeah. yeah I have it. Oh, look at that. There's, there's prizes inside for finding it. Whoa, thank you. And what I yeah. tell people is if you didn't bring a prize to exchange, you can always bring one next time. Well, yeah, there you, you go. Can sign your name in there. And if you want, you can go online and say you found it online too. And online, there's all kinds of these, thousands of these all over the world. Some of them are easy to find and some are really hard. My favorite aspect of this is there's what's called geocoins. And I don't know if there's one in there, but they have a, a code on them and you put the code in when you when you find it so the person So then I said my name follow mm -hmm. it around the world. Oh no kidding. Yeah. Oh you just keep re eye got it. Alright, yeah, that is neat. I'm not that small of a layer. So you can take one thing out of the, the prize bag if you'd like to. Okay. Or do you want to you want to wait until you bring a prize back? Yeah, I want to wait until I bring a prize. Okay. Back. Well, you can bring it to any geocache you want to. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's pretty neat. You got a Fitbit? Is that what you got there? Yep. And I got my ten thousand steps. Already? Wow. wow. It's ten thousand one hundred and two. Wow. <laughs> it's, only, it's only like nine o'clock. You're going to take a lot of steps today. Yeah. Well, what can I say? I can give you a lot of steps. <coughs> well, I got my steps yesterday. Oh. It's a little soggy. A little soggy? It's a walk-up bow leg. You know what bow leg it is? No. Like this. Well, uh, walk up on the outsides. Yeah. Just that one step is a little... I think it's the seventh one. You like it? Just use the hand rails. why we do it.
So, we're going down red, but not the way we came up, right? Yep. We're going to make it a little more catskilly for Logan. Plus, there's a spring where we can re-up on water and a shelter. So, you can get a look at what a, well, it's almost like an AT shelter, but they're like this in the cash skills too. A little different path on this, so make sure you watch. Take your time, watch every step. seeing if a quarter mile it says so you gotta come around on the other side to see what they're telling you so we go this way quarter mile I think the spring is just before it or just after it one of the two I don't know trail pipe lean in the Catskills This is a little more. Cat skilly? Yep. I don't know why they call it the cat skills. Because you have to be like a cat to climb all this. Deep and very rocky. Yeah, they make like nice little steps. Yeah, kinda. Big steps, but that's the way. It is a spring. It is a spring. It's not the one we're looking for, though. You're just gonna basically walk down those rocks over there. They're going to be slick though, so. Is this the spring? This is the spring. Whoa. I believe there should be a pipe up in here. Yep. Right there. All right. Let me get my filter out and I'll grab some water and take it to the lean to with us. Good enough. Should be the way to lean to. This way? Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. Are they milkweed or the milk? No idea. They got milkweed now. Shelter. Cash Skill 3500 Club. It's 
very stable, Daddy. No lunch break. Yep. Well, lunch break. And um, we are in the shelter right now. It's a pretty big one, too. Uh, let's see if we can read it. So Logan got a cool card from the conservation officer up there at the fire tower. So that's pretty cool. You lucked out, huh? Huh? You lucked out. Huh? They're not always there like that. I am lucked out. All right. Daddy's gonna go check out the privy. Okay. I think that you find these at normal shelters. Normally there's just a place up in the woods that you have to go to. There you go. That's that. My advice, always take a stick when you put the lid up and kind of swoosh it around the eggs and make sure there's no spiders or anything else waiting to bite your... So we finished up lunch, still at the shelter. We are uh, just kind of taking it easy. Taking our time. What are we doing, bud? Lollygagging. We're lollygagging. No hurry. It's still, it's not even 12 o'clock yet. It's uh, 10 minutes to 12. Okay. So, that trail is not, I mean, it's steep, but it's not ridiculous. So, I mean, we probably should be back to the truck in about an hour and then maybe check out a few other things while we're here. Yeah. So. We're just chilling. We're going to pull out in about 10, 15 minutes and get back on the trail. We still got to walk well, probably about, what is that, a quarter mile? Uh, I think so. Out to the trail and then down. Oh, I think it's only about between half and three quarters of a mile down to the intersection. And then we'll be straight lining it downhill to the truck. So you only have like a half mile of a little bit crazy, but not too crazy trail left. Oh, okay. I was saying to Logan, in the fall, in the winter, you probably got a pretty good view looking right out of the shelter. I don't think this is gonna... If all these leaves were not here... No, nope, it's too hazy, but there's mountains out there. Yeah, you can just see them. Ready to hit the trail? Yep. Okay, we'll say bye to the shelter. Bye, shelter. We'll see you whenever we come back. Want to lead us back to the main trail? Oh. It's this one. You remember these sod logs? Yeah. So this is the main trail junction here. Uh, which way do we go? Well, you want to climb back up everything? Huh? Or you want to go downhill to the truck? Truck. <laughs>
probably a little better when it's dry. It's probably suicide in the winter. With that spring running down, this is probably just all ice. Get some cat skills in. We've made it to the trail junction. And I'm pretty sure Logan's gonna be very happy about that. Made it to the trail junction. What do you think about that? Here, see how long we have to go? Um, nine. Point nine. So just under a mile. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. So we are back on the blue trail. Yeah. And Logan's happy we didn't go up that red trail, right? Because there wasn't even much fun going down either. No. That was kind of, kind of steep. Yes, and very rocky and very, um, I don't know what to do. Slippy? Huh? Slippy? Yes. The spring just dumps out onto it and basically runs the whole way down. But, pretty much smooth sailing from here on out. Registration box. Time to, time to sign out. Mm. There we are. There you go. Signed out of your third first. Not too much farther to get back to the truck. Nope. Now you can really see it. We made it. Logan's first 35. Yeah, yeah. And fire tower. Uh-huh. We did it. And it is one, no, uh, one o'clock. One o three. Oh, nice. We fetched at a pretty decent time. Yeah. Okay, what do you think you got? Four. Four? How about 
5.47 Catskill miles which are different than Pennsylvania miles How are they different? Because it's steeper mm -hmm. a little bit harder And what elevation gain did we get? Total was 2,508 feet Have a snack and chill out and go check a couple things out and get on the road. What do you think? Yeah. And then uh, drive home. And then there's something I think we'll probably want to do tonight. Whoa. Well, being that we just climbed a mountain, I'm thinking hot tub is back on, back on the menu. What do you think? Yeah. So. Hot tub time. Hot tub time. <laughs>